This presentation will help you write the advertising essay, essay number 3A-B. It's two to three pages again. You're going to use the same strategy that you used for essay 2A-B because you're comparing and contrasting good and bad advertising. It's 200 points for the uh, essay number 3B, the final version, and that will be due in week five. This week you have the uh, rough draft and remember no late assignments because I need time to give you feedback. You'll submit this in the weeks four and five drop boxes. Now to choose the ads you had four different ways uh, in the written instructions. You can use the textbook that would work very well for the effective ad. You could choose something from the internet, YouTube or a manufacturer's website. You could choose a print ad, scan it and then include it as an attachment. You can even describe one of the ads, not both, and I would suggest that would be the bad advertisement because the textbook does have many examples of good ads. Now when you brainstorm, try to figure out why are you analyzing these ads? What point are you making? Uh, what are you going to prove about the effect that they have on society? Is it a good effect, a bad effect? Why? You start first by analyzing the target audience and then you think about the goals of the advertiser. Now, because this is comparison contrast, decide whether you want point by point or block. You could use either pattern. And you know to avoid plagiarism, of course. Formal writing again, you want to use words like he, she, it, they, never I, me, you, or your. Your word choices should be formal for this, uh, very professional. And you want to paragraph effectively. Uh, most of the time you'll start with a topic sentence as the first sentence. It will state the one central idea in the paragraph. All the other sentences will support that idea. And if you change to a different point, then you start a new paragraph. Now when you create the essay, you of course first have to decide on your ads, the good and bad ads and or commercials. You could compare an ad to a commercial if it's on the same topic. Then you decide on your approach, point by point or block. You outline the assignment, write the rough draft, revise it as often as you need to, Give that rough draft to me in the Dropbox by Saturday of this week, week four. Submit the final essay by Saturday of week five. That's 200 points. And remember your academic guidelines. Always use Times New Roman 12, never Calibri 11. I really hate that font. It's very difficult to read. Your contact information, like your name, goes on the left margin, not in a header or a text box. Uh, check that before and after spacing uh, in the paragraphing link and set it to zero, not 10 or 8 or multiple or auto. And don't hit the enter key after every line. Of course, if you have questions, you'll call me and or write or both, and I'll be happy to help you. Good luck on this essay.